This is day seven at the retaining wall project. As you can see that it's, uh, the wall's really coming together now. Um, you can see the essentially the finished height here, how it kind of steps down into the existing grade. Um, <clears throat> the guys took the drainage pipe and ran it along, and they're going to tie it in with the existing uh, drain pipe that they have here, which leads out into the street. Um, but it really, really, really looks nice. And the only other thing we have to do now is finish off this one other section of wall that they're doing at the end. And we actually changed the plan a little bit. Instead of capping it off with this stone, we're going to cap it off with um, uh, a blue stone. So it's going to be dimensionally cut, and it's going to overhang uh, the edge of the wall. And we're actually going to we're going to be putting um, uh, retaining wall lights in. So. Uh, the plan changed a little bit, and again, you'll uh, you'll see how we do that and uh, the finished product. And uh, it's really, really coming together. You can see the geotextile fabric in the back that runs all along. Uh, <clears throat> all the drainage stone in the back that helps to alleviate all that uh, soil pressure and water pressure every time it rains. And along with the pipe, um, a lot of the water should either just seep through the wall or just follow this pipe and go out to the street. So it's um, day seven here at the retaining wall project and like I said everything's really looking great here and uh, we'll be back tomorrow with another update and we'll show you how to we're going to put in the low voltage lighting.